All right, lesson five, fundamentals of a transfer case. The derivative of the fundamental of the transfer case. Given information, construction, lubrication, operation, transfer case. Learning event one, describe the construction, operation, transfer case. The previous lessons of the, we discussed how the transmission could provide the various gear ratio of the engine could be developed with enough power to start of the engine. Start a vehicle running at high speed, pulling heavy loads. We also mentioned the military vehicles have the ability to operate mud, snow, sand, high unusual terrains. Due to the driving, the power is to be able to front wheels as well as the rear wheels of the vehicle that will not get stuck. Therefore, tactical military vehicles include the um, second gearbox of the transfer gate for the purpose of the take output power transmission device so that it will drive with the rear wheels at the all time of the drive with the front wheels when needed. Show the uh, typical drive line, drive line arrangement of the transfer assembly. Transfer cave that can be mounted on the top of the wave of the vehicle, separate component mounted on the rear of the transmission drive with the propeller shaft connected with the output shaft. Transmission can also be part of the transmission drive gear output shaft of the transmission transfer case. Performs one or more of the following functions. Transfer the transmission power point low enough to the propeller shaft that can be mounted with under the engine power from the front axle. Provide output for the power of one or more rear axle. Provide higher or lower gear ratio vehicle that do not have necessary gear reductions in the transmission. Provide arrangements over the engaging, disengaging front wheel drive and high-low ranges when applicable. Because in many of the functions, shape of the mounting of the construction appearance of the transfer of the various vehicles will differ. The following paragraphs will discuss the wheel vehicle transfer cases. Transfer case due to the M151A1, one quarter ton tron vehicle is mounted directly on the transmission. Transfer does not provide separate gear reduction. It has only one direct drive. It does have a shift lever for the engaging, disengaging front wheel drive. Transfer case of the M561, one and a quarter ton truck is mounted with the output of the end of the transmission transfer the power to transmission to propeller shaft the differential selection of high and low operation range of the neutral disengaged case and two and the six wheel drive two wheel drive the disengage in front with the rear axle leaving only center wheel to drive the wheels three quarter inch ton and one and a quarter ton truck use the same type of the transfer um, they are mounted behind the transmission connected to the output transmission they contain a high low range of engaging disengaging front wheel drive with ranging selection with a dual done manually with the shifting levers Two and a half, one tr two and a half ton, and a five ton truck transfer. Some of them mounted behind the transmission power with a propeller shaft. All have the high and low range for the most likely with the being a lever. On some of the vehicles, you have the front wheel drive that engages automatically any rear wheels, starting turning faster than front wheels. This is done sprag even similar to the bicycle coaster brake. On other road modes, the front wheel drive that engages disengaged manual shaft. Are your front, uh, front, front, or, 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 or discussions less than we refer to the transfer cases? Two and a half ton truck on trucks primarily. Most of the tra transfer work in the same. Of the more unit level, the maintenance of the two and a half ton transfer for the most other models. Our construction of typical transfer, um, to understand the transfer case work the best way to become familiar with the location of the internal part of the typical transfer assembly with the one input shaft of the three output shaft of the other transfer. We have one input shaft of the two output shaft of the one shaft of the axle of one over the rear axle of the operation will be much the same. We'll discuss the components as they are listed. Right, this shows the uh, uh, typical dimensional transfer assembly for the 6x6 six six vehicle. At the top of the illustration, look at the gear one is mounted with the main shaft of the three, with the, as three of the rotate without the turning shaft of the external teeth of the outside of the air and air concept of the mesh for the gear fourteen. Also, for the internal gear with the teeth on the inside of the gear two is also mounted with the main input shaft of the three, without the notes of the gear supplying with the shaft that must turn any time the input shaft turns. You can slide back and then forth on the shaft of the gear between gears one and four. Um, the gear has the external teeth with the dog clutch between the gears one and shaft three. Um, gear four of the rear axle of the rear unit with the drive axle fastened in the turn of the five of the rear axle of the rear, rear, rear unit to drive the shaft of the sum of the gear four is meshed with the gear six. Uh, the shaft of the constant mesh gear of the gear six with both external and internal teeth is mounted on and free of the turn on the item seven of the idle shaft of the idle shaft containing the mesh gear of the mesh gear eight on the drive of the shaft of the constant mesh gear. The driver shaft of the constant mesh gear with the external and internal teeth with the mounted on the item nine on the rear axle the front unit with the drive shaft external tooth gear fastened on the item nine on the mesh and the internal teeth on the drive shaft of the constant mesh gear eight. The gear turns item nine on the rear axle front unit with the drive shaft of the gear eight is in the mesh with the gear ten and the drive shaft of the, the shaft of the constant mesh gear. Gear has external internal teeth that mounted on and free and turn on item eleven, the front axle drive shaft. Gear 12, the drive shaft sliding gear has the internal teeth with the internal splines, can slide splines on front axle drive shaft with the external, external teeth of gear 12 and the mesh for the internal teeth of the drive shaft, constant mesh gear of the 10 with the front axle drive shaft engaged will turn on the same speed with the gear 10. Our gear 13, other speed shaft, low speed gear mounted on the other shaft on one end of the gear 13 on the mesh shaft engaged with the gear 6. 
Others shall have a concept of mesh gear out of their end of the mesh and gauge of the item. Level 14, and others take eye. Others shall have a concept of mesh gear, the lock gear, set, locking gear 6, 13, 14 together so that they throw in a unit. Others shall have a concept of mesh gear 14 is in mesh for the main shaft, concept of mesh gear 1. All right, operation. Um, now that you have seen how the parts of the transfer fit together, they will take a uh, look at uh, what goes on with the transfer operation, the transfer operating in high range, front wheel drive, engaged, and all wheels and pulling. Park them with the transfer transmission, power main shaft three with the main shaft turning to the main shaft sliding gear two turns because of the displaying with the main shaft high range of the main shaft sliding with the gear in the mesh with the internal gear one main shaft again to mesh gear. And the cause of the gear one to turn. The external teeth of the gear one are in the mesh. External teeth gear of the 14, the idler shaft of the mesh gear mesh. One gear, one gear one turn, the drive gear 14 turn, drive gear 14. On the other end, 13, the idler show low speed gear of the mesh with the gear 14. Other ends of the mesh with gear six, the other idler shaft the cons of mesh gear that means with the where gear 14 turns all gears on the idler shaft turn. Gear six in the mesh gear for the four with the gear six of the turn with the drive gear four with the gear uh, drives gear four with gear four turns shaft five which sends sends with the rear axle rear unit. Gear six also meshes you with the drive gear eight with the internal teeth with the gear eight within mesh with the gear with the fast in the shaft nine. When the gear eight is turned with the power sent with the rear axle from the front unit. Gear eight also meshes with the turns gear ten with the um, front wheel drive with the engage with the gear ten mesh with the drive gear twelve with the drive shaft with the sliding gear with the twelve um gear twelve with the spline and the shaft eleven front axle drive shaft with the gear twelve with the turn with the power through the shaft eleven the front axle driver means of the uh, shifting lever linkage can slide gear twelve away from gear ten with the gear twelve with the not with the mesh with the gear ten with no power being sent in the front axle. All right, and one more, more time, torque is needed the most. More move vehicle to drive with the can shaft with the transfer long range. Shifting linkage, some vehicle with the maze of the vehicle must be front wheel to drive with the shifting low range. Remember the driver sliding, sending full torque with the rear wheels, the only which might cause damage. When transfer shifted to low range of the main shift, the driver sliding gear two with the distance gear with the constant mesh gear one. Gives the idler shaft lower speed gear 13, gear two with the driving gear um, is smaller than the driving driven gear 13. Gives less less speed, the more torque with the gear reduction. How with the how for here on the power flow, the same in the high range. The transfer of the neutral while gear in two is not mesh, either gear one or gear or gear. All right, learning event two: discover the construction operation of the spag unit. Some of the transfer contained with the overrunning of the spag unit or unit with the front of the output shaft with the operation of these units is much like with the overrunning clutch of the starting motor on these units. Transfer is made with the drive of the front axle light slower than the rear axle of the driving during normal operation. Good road with both the front and rear wheels or will turn the speed only with the rear wheels drive of the vehicle with the how with the rear wheels will start the slip the turn faster than the front wheels. And this happened this red automatically engaged with the front wheels to also drive with the vehicle. The spag also simply provides the automatic means of engaging front wheel drive whenever the back wheel starts to slip. Therefore, the three types of sprag units are used to transfer the single sprag unit, the double sprag unit, and the air operated double sprag unit. They all work almost the same way that a type of the transfer is made. It's much like one we discussed earlier. Um, the main difference with the sprag unit is instead of the hand operated sliding gear with the clutch of the front of the output shaft. Sprag and seal bracket um, block is shaped with, um, at the edge at the wedge of the complete assembly. Some of the um, units of the 42 sprag with assembled the outer reef to help and play with the two springs. Spring fits in the notch of the ends of the sprags hold them in place, and the outer race of the driven with the gear of the front output shaft with the iron race of the front output shaft. Now let's see with the single spring operate with the general normal operation front and rear wheel string at the same speed. The outer race of the sprag unit with the driven gear with the turn little or slower. Another inner race of the um, front output shaft that prevents the sprag from wedging between the races. Now I'll look up the take of the plate for the front wheels turn freely. They are not driven. However, the rear wheels start to slip with the turn faster than the front wheels. The outer race with the turn faster the inner race. When this happened, the sprag wedged in the jam between the two races. The two races now turn the unit. Provide driving power to the front of the wheels. As soon as the rear wheels are quite slipping, start turning the same speed with the front wheels and sprag releases. Uh, this shows your um, typical output shaft driving gear with the energized spring. Sprag outer race, um, spragging number marks, and then your teeth. Um, 
It is uh, in reverse necessary to look out for the single sprag even the turn uh, the turn is reversed that means that we cannot drive with the sprag even locate with the gun with the linkage with the transmission shift the reverse shift collar with the transfer of the reverse shift collar to shift the internal spline with the collar match with the external spline with the reverse shaft driven the gear with the front output gear so the solid drive the round with the sprag unit double sprag unit operates the same way as single sprag forward speed the difference between the unions shows up in the reverse the double sprag unit second sprag has uh, and been an added switch which operates only in reverse. When a shift made in reverse, the forward sprag locked out um, and about almost exactly the same single leap sprag unit of the reverse sprag unit now comes operation front wheel drive of the reverse when rear wheels start to slip and shift from one sprag to the other down. Linkage to the transmission shift of the reverse left shifter um, collar and then transfer of the reverse shift collar is shifted in internal spline or teeth collar unmatched with external spline of the outer of the one sprag unit within the mesh external plane to the outer sprag unit. Another type of sprag unit, the air control of the double sprag unit, the unit does the same job with the double sprag unit. You will just discover the main difference the air valve with the transmission lower reverse shift or shaft. The air ver ver value automatically shaft the sprag unit forward reverse and whenever the transmission is shifted low front or reverse. And this shows they pick air control diagram transmission transfer using air control double sprag unit. Uh, the illustration shows the air control diagram of transmission transfer is only with the air control double sprag with the type of the unit in the five ton truck. Now let's take a look at what happens when they compress the air system in the transmission forward neutral position. Air cylinder control valve will air add mid air under the pressure compressor air system shift the air control assembly. The air is submitted with the forward shift um, side with the spring blades plan spring balance position piston and cylinder. Remove the piston with the cylinder control valve submitted with the opposite side. Of the piston, the um causes engagement of the reverse sprag unit. The forward sprag is engaged. Front wheels and front free wheel, front free wheel turn on the on, only with the forward direction. If the reverse sprag is in, unit is engaged, front wheels cannot be turned in forward direction. And per vehicle pressure and system transmission neutral cannot be pu pushed backward until the transmission shift is reversed. Transfer use the dip and splash lubricating system. The gears are transfer cable the case of the fill. The gear and oil, GO90 with warm weather, and the gears operate with the turn of oil and no pressures. You the turning gears will throw the oil under the shaft and into the bearings. Oil is kept from leaking from the case or in seals around input and output shafts. It goes through the practice exercise and intention page left blank. And this was... And this was a... Uh, All right, and this was um, this was your U.S. Army light weight 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 light weight vehicle mechanic MO 63B skill level three wheel veil clutch transmission transfer case of course number zero D one thousand five OD one thousand five five credit hours hours Urban Dean Proving Grounds Maryland testing.